Thank you for checking out this demonstration on how to easily turn a PDF into a helpful instructional video. For this example, I am going to use Auto Video Creator's instructional PDF to create a quick video. For the sake of keeping this demonstration short, I will only be creating one slide. Here is some insight on exactly what I will be doing in this demonstration to create this video. First, I will take a screenshot of the part of the PDF I want to show on the slide. I will then paste this screenshot into Paint so I can crop the image to fit in the slide. From there, I simply import the image and add the text of what I want to be said during that slide. Finally, I will hide the text so it does not show in the final video render. It's easy, just watch. That was obviously done in AVC. Okay, so here's what we're doing. We're taking a screenshot of a PDF. In this case, we're actually using the PDF from uh, AVC. Now we're pasting the image in Paint to crop it, all right? Because we're gonna crop the image so that it's the right size that we could put in a slide. Once we put it in the slide, we're going to actually copy the text from the PDF, but I'm getting ahead of myself. So you see that we're obviously resizing it in paint, and now we're going to save the image so that we can import it into Auto Video Creator. So we save the image. Now keep in mind, you have to know where you're saving it so you can find it again. And we're going to go over to ABC, and now what we're gonna do is insert that image, all right? So you click on Insert, and then Image, and then we'll import it that way. And we just look for the same image from before, which is the PDF, the cropped PDF. And now we're going to put it right inside because eventually that's what's going to be seen, even though right now we're going to copy from it. All right, so as we're playing with this, we're actually going to copy some of the text from the PDF and then put it into the slide. Now, what we're going to do first is make adjustments to make the image look good. part I was telling you about, we're copying and pasting the text and then we're making the adjustments so that the text to speech sounds right. Just adding more text here. Now we're going to copy a good batch of this PDF right here, this, this big area. Okay, inserting that last bit of text. Here's the clever part. What we're going to do is actually hide that text that's on there and let the computer voice read it without people actually seeing it. So in other words, she's going to appear to be reading the PDF itself that people see. So let's save and render the video. And now we'll play the video. The top menu bar contains the following items. File, insert, options, find images, and create video. From the file menu the following items are available. New, open, save, save as, and exit. The following options will do the following tasks. New. Selecting this option will clear the current slide project and begin with a blank canvas. Open. Selecting this option will open a browse menu to find a previously saved project. Save. The first time you select this option will open a browse menu to select where to save your project. 
Subsequent saves will be silent. Save as. Selecting this option will open the browse menu to select where to save the project with a new file name. Did you see how simple that was? Now of course, this is just a small sample, but it is easy to see how you can easily create training and instructional videos with Auto Video Creator. Whether you are using a PDF to develop your video, or creating training from scratch, Auto Video Creator makes it simple to do. Again, what you just saw is the finished result from ABC, and then you saw that we put together those last couple of slides where the computer voice was explaining to you right now what actually just went on. So we actually used it in two different ways, bumped right up against each other just now. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. Your head must be spinning with possibilities. Auto Video Creator is certainly a nifty little tool.